Hi everybody, everybody I'm back. Everybody Jeannie Young is back and I'm back with yet another amazing recipe. I am so excited yet another day because today at the Young's house Gina Young is going to share with you all how easy it is to make a delicious hot ham and cheese sandwich. This recipe right here is bomb. It's so easy to make. It doesn't require a lot of ingredients. And you know, make a Gina Young style. It's going to be so tasty. Y'all never had my hot ham and cheese sandwich before. You better make yourself. Here are the lovely ingredients you will need. You're going to need some Kaiser rolls. I love Kaiser rolls when I think hot ham and cheese. Now we have some Kaiser rolls here and we also have some butter bread. You're gonna need a nice sweet Vidalia onion and some lunch meat. So right here I have some nice thin sliced old farmer's ham and I have some baby Swiss. You will need some eggs. So I have two large eggs here, some garlic powder. We have some sandwich spread and mayonnaise and we're gonna use some butter. Make sure your hands are impeccably clean. Let's get started with this really quick and simple yet so tasty recipe. Hot ham and Swiss sandwich is on the menu. I couldn't be more excited. This by far is one of my favorite sandwiches. So now, here's the first thing you wanna do. Let's go ahead and cut into our onion, okay? And we're gonna saute up some onions. We're gonna get some nice color onto these onions. You cannot make a ham and Swiss sandwich here at the Young's without some sauteed onions. So we're going to do just that. I hope you all are having an amazing day today. Let me know in the comment section below if ham and Swiss is something that you like to have at your house. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to chop it just like so. And I am so thankful right now that my eyes are not watering like a waterfall. <laughs> Okay, so now we'll get that out of the way. When I come back, we'll get started frying up our eggs and I'm gonna show you how I like to make my eggs for this sandwich. So for this sandwich, what I like to do is I like to fry the eggs nice and hard. Some of you might want, and I like to crack the yolk. I always crack the yolk. Some of you might want to do your um, egg and have the yolk nice and runny. If that's what you wanna do, absolutely it would be delicious. So here's what I wanna do. We're gonna salt and pepper our egg just like so. Time to get our eggs turned over. And you see the reason why I like to crack the yolk because I like for that yolk to be spread all across the white part of the egg. All right, we're gonna get it turned over just like so. Same thing here. Here in a second, those will be done and we'll assemble our sandwich. So while we wait on our eggs to get done, let's go ahead and saute up our onions. I have a little tiny bit of vegetable oil onto our skillet here. But I am gonna put a little bit of butter on, just a little bit of butter in the butter. What the butter will do is it will help to caramelize the onions and get them nice and golden brown. That's what I'm looking for. And I'm also gonna put a little bit of salt and pepper onto the onions. Absolutely. We're going to make our way over to the eggs and get them out of the pan. Be right back. Now that we have our gorgeous eggs out of the pan, let's go ahead and take a peek in at our onions. Oh, and they're starting to get that golden brown color. Exactly what I'm looking for. While we wait on the onions, here's what we'll do. Let's go ahead and take our bread and get it nice and buttered up. I like to use the Kaiser rolls when I make my sandwich. I'm gonna show you how I like to make my sandwich, but then I'm also, in this video, I'm gonna show you how I like to make my family's sandwich. This is what they like. Okay, so we have their bread out. Gorgeous, nice, soft bread. You know, look at that, gorgeous. Okay, and I'm cooking my onions on a medium heat. Because you don't want them to burn. You don't want the char, but you do want golden brown color. Okay, so now that we have that done, let's go ahead and butter both sides of our bread so we can get it nice and grilled up. Not too much butter is needed. Gorgeous. And you also can use mayonnaise. Anytime I make some type of grilled sandwich, 
you can use mayonnaise and it gives you a beautiful golden brown color as well. All right, it does the same thing that butter would do. Okay, so we're gonna get all four sides done just like this and we're gonna put some mayonnaise or if your loved ones like the sandwich spread, you can put sandwich spread in the middle. Okay, just like this, let's flip our bread over, assemble our sandwich, just like so. Look, look how thin, look how thin, yes. <laughs> Ooh, you have to get the meat sliced nice and thin so you can pile the meat on, you know? All right, so what we're gonna do, here's what I like to do. I like to put some Swiss in the middle. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. And then we're gonna put more cheese or more ham. And then, like I said, more cheese. Load that ham, don't be afraid. Okay. Just like this. And then you take your egg. Oh. <laughs> Listen here, let's do this. Let's put the egg right there. Let's put the cheese right here. We're gonna do a little bit of mayo. Just like so on the inside. We're gonna get this nice and grilled up. When I come back, I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do with the onions. Okay, our onions are almost done. We want to season them. We're gonna season with garlic powder, or you can also put the garlic powder on your ham if you like. Okay, and I'm not gonna use the salt on the um, onions because it's really not needed. Reason why is because your ham is salty enough. So let's take some of these gorgeous onions. Oh, ooh, listen here, put them on there. Just like that, gorgeous. Take the mayonnaise side, put it on here. We're gonna get this onto our flat top and we're gonna cook both sides until it's nice, beautiful, and golden brown. Let's get this other sandwich made up, just like so. Same thing, go ahead and take you some mayonnaise, just like this, beautiful. Oh, wee, you better make you some. You better make you some Gina Young style. This is gorgeous, even after it cools down, wrap it up. Take it outside, have a picnic with the sandwich. Your family and friends will love you for this sandwich. And it's, it's really like, it sends your taste buds into confusion when they taste the ham and the melty Swiss and the egg and the sauteed onions. It's just like, it's a wow factor sandwich here. All right, everyone that eats this sandwich, they go absolutely berserk over it pretty much. A little bit more ham. Oh yeah. All right, cheese. And then we're gonna do the onions. Once again, give me some more of these gorgeous onions. Nice and seasoned with that garlic powder. Listen here. You ain't know, had a sandwich until you had one Gina Young style. All right, we got that egg on there. Yeah, you're on there, okay? This is going on the flat top until it's nice and golden brown, and I'll be right back. Okay, so now for the sandwich that's gonna go on the Kaiser roll. We're gonna take some mayonnaise, and we're going to lightly dress the inside of our bun. We're gonna get this bun nice and toasty. I love a Kaiser roll, guys, like I seriously do. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take it, put it right on your flat top. If you don't have a flat top, it's okay. Put it onto your frying pan until it gets nice, beautiful, and golden brown. This one here should be just about ready to turn. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna turn my heat up because what I wanna do is I wanna get a darker color. But we'll turn that back over to get that color. When I come back, I'll show you what to do next. Time to turn our sandwiches over. You should see that gold. That's the color that I'm looking for, baby. Oh, yes. Ooh, we get in my belly. That's the sandwich. All right, now here's the one that's gonna go on the Kaiser roll. Look at the ham and look how I stacked it. Go ahead and take that cheese. We're gonna just lay it just like so. And we're gonna let that ham steam and let that cheese melt. Meanwhile, I want you to take a look at this gorgeous Kaiser roll. All I'm gonna do with mine is I want that ham to heat up 
I want that cheese to get nice and melty and stringy, and I'm gonna put it on this bad boy that we butter with the mayonnaise. This one right here is nice, beautiful, and golden brown. Look at that right there. And remember, we put that egg in there. We got the sauteed onions in there. Oh, my mouth is salivating. Let's take a peek in at this one and see where it's at. It may not be done, but if it's not, let's just have patience. Let's turn it over and see. Oh, gorgeous. We're getting there. Listen here, everybody. If you all enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting on? Tell your family and friends and everyone you know, tell the whole world about Gina Young, what I'm doing in this kitchen on a daily basis. When I come back, I'm gonna say an amazing prayer. You all are gonna get that first bite. So what I've done with this one is I've created a heat tent just by using foil and it's gonna create steam and the steam is gonna create, you know, uh, you know, the cheese is gonna be able to melt that way. So we're waiting on that. And I feel like this one is done. Let's go ahead and get it off. Let's go ahead and say a prayer. I'm gonna slice this up so you all can have a bite. Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus, we wanna thank you for another beautiful day today. Lord, we thank you for your love, time, your mercy, and your understanding. Please forgive us for our sins. Come into our hearts. We make you our Lord and Savior. Send your angels down to surround us day and night your Holy Spirit to help us make good decisions. Give us peace over our minds in the name of Jesus. We pray that no weapons formed against us shall prosper. Bind the devil away from us in Jesus' name. Devil, you have no authority over this household. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the roof of our head, the food, the love, peace and the joy that you bring us every day. Amen. And we have our hot ham and cheese going on to the Kaiser roll. <laughs> oh! oh right there let's go ahead look at that what we are going to do let's give them a nice cut because i want you to see the egg i want you to see the sauteed onions i want you to see the melty cheese oh <laughs> this is perfect we're going to eat this outside and enjoy the weather oh wait till i just wait till i split it <laughs> yes if you don't want it that way make you one this way look at this gorgeousness these are what you call ham and swiss sandwiches gina young style make you some take a look at it everybody hot ham and swiss sandwiches gina young style make you some i know you're ready i know you're ready and i'm gonna give you that bite look at look at the egg in there Ooh, and when you taste those onions that has that garlic on there and the melty swiss cheese couldn't get any better take a bite <laughs> i know <laughs> i know and this one right here my goodness girl you gonna set it off in here and as always <laughs>